Ah, fishing in New World, definitely one of the most dreaded skills for players to max, but I mean, we can't blame the top tier devs at Amazon for the lack of creativity, right? Boring. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how you can super easily make a bot in Python for this extremely one-dimensional fishing system. Don't worry about easy anti-cheat either. This type of bot is 100% visual and is undetectable to their systems. Just make sure you add some randomness to it so it ain't as easy to detect. 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 Before we go any further, I need y'all to hit that like button, contemplate subscribing, and flip a coin on whether you'll hit the bell icon or not, all right? Just so you'll know, we are a small nonprofit with the goal of educating and certifying people in the computer science realm. Basically, college is over. He ain't lying. Don't waste your time or your money with outdated institutions. If you're curious about learning more or volunteering, join our Discord via the link in the description. So let's go over the bot. I'm currently running Python version 3.9.7. You'll need New World installed, obviously, and uh, we're gonna be utilizing the Python modules, PyAuto GUI, and PyDirect input. Additionally, you'll need to install Pillow and OpenCV. The README and the GitHub link will have this all listed out for you. So right at the beginning of the script, I have laid out all the variables. So right at the beginning of the script, I have laid out all the variables you can edit. There's a lot of randomness included by default. This is in order to help you avoid detection. You will see two types of variables. One is a base time, the other is a random time. For example, the casting base time. This means that my cast will always be at least one second long. Just so you know, if you cast exactly 1.9 seconds, you'll max out your cast. <laughs> the casting random variable will add a random amount of time up to what you see here. So what that means is my cast times right now will be anywhere between 1 and 1.4 seconds long. This variable is for waiting for animations to finish, and this one is for moving into one of two directions. This will be done periodically in order to avoid AFK disconnection. Just like our last bot, we'll find the New World window, select it, then move our mouse over to the center of the window and click, escaping the New World escape menu. In order to make the bot faster, only the middle third of the New World window is ever analyzed. Now, this bot does assume you have already prepped your fishing rod with bait, so make sure you've done that before you run it. So now let's move on to the infinite loop. I have absolutely no idea what's going on. Your casting and reeling times get auto-calculated at the beginning of the loop. Then your line is casted. Your bot will then look for the fish icon in order to continue on. Also, we need to force garbage collection on memory or else your computer might crash. Don't ask me how I figured this out. I, I, don't, I don't really want to talk about it. You then will click to hook the fish. You will forever reel on the line until the text hold cast shows up on screen. The time delay for scanning the screen to look for the hold cast icon is usually enough for the reel down time. But if you need more time, you can uncomment this line here in order to get more time. And then here at the end of the script, you will see you have a 20% chance of moving. This is in order to avoid the AFK timer. When you do move, it will randomly choose between going right and left. And that's it. Of course, like I said in the last video, you can mess with the confidence if you want. Those values are what work for me. Everything here has also been tested on only 1080p resolution. So if you render your game at any other resolution, it's not guaranteed that all this will work. You may need to adjust things. If you guys have any questions or ideas for future videos in regards to AI, machine learning, quantum computer, cybersecurity, or anything else, drop a comment or join our Discord. Thanks y'all for watching and remember to like this video and subscribe. I'll see you guys on the next video.